Hey everybody, it's Abby. I am back today because I got three pieces of vape mail and I put my camera on a tripod. I've had one for a long time, not the camera, the tripod. And I didn't realize I could put it behind my monitor and I can adjust it down onto my desk. So I'm going to practice using it, showing you what I got in the mail. And that will help me when I start to wrap coils on camera, just using the camera. I got three packages. One is from Alice in Vapeland, and one is from Pirate Vape Store, and one is from Vermilion River. Now, I've never ordered from Vermilion River before, but I've heard good things about them. So, I'm going to try adjusting the camera down on the desk. So, here we go. Whee! There we are. Okay. This first one is from Alice in Vapeland. Their packages are always fun to open. I already did an opening for one of their boxes before. There's a personalized note, and it says, My dear Evelyn, thank you so much for joining me for tea. I am as happy as can be. Let's look inside this little box and see what we can see. And she has a little cup of tea on her head, and a little teapot in the background, and they see little bunny ears at the bottom. little playing card that says silence in the court and a whole bunch of confetti and it's um, black and orange and brown there's a little bit of blue in there but it looks kind of festive for Halloween and pumpkin tumble is the juice that I got I don't know my camera is here and it comes with a little charm which is a little Pumpkin. Hold that focus for a second. There we go. And it has the glass stripper. It's sealed. And let's see what else I got here. Lucky number seven. And this is out of the testing room. And lavender ever after. And that was also out of the testing room. And I got a sample of creamsicle. Okay. Oh, and I forgot they paint a little picture on the inside of the box lid. So this looks kind of like a cloud of vapors to me. It's pretty. Okay, we'll open Vermilion River next. making a big mess. There's two glass eyedroppers, or droppers I should say. I like the juices when they come in a box instead of a bag, especially when they're glass. Goodness, this one's hard to get into. This one is called Malibu Pineapple. It's a dark brown glass bottle. I really don't know how to focus this with it at the angle that it's at. But 
but there's a sticker here on the side that tells what flavor it is. <clears throat> Cinnamon rolls. And the last one is caramelized cappuccino. So they all sound very good to me. I'll probably take a sneak test and then let them steep a little bit. Okay, and the last one is from Pirate Babe Store. And this has got the vanilla custard in it. And yum yum. I remember those. I really like when I get a business card. I don't care for just the letter because I collect the business cards. Here's a, yet my third sample of Double Dutch, which is a chocolate mint. Don't care for it. Hershey's candy bar. This one is called T Chew. I'm going to actually move this back up now when I got the boxes open. I wanted you to see the Alice in Vapeland box mostly. Now this camera's up higher than I'm used to, but anyway, the label says T Chew, and this is a uh, fruit stripe gum. Smell it. Smells good. It smells fruity. And then we have a Kit Kat bar. Here is Captain's Custard. Nice big bottle of that. Yum yum. This is supposed to be um, different smooth flavors. I think that's what it says, smooth flavors blended together. And I have tasted this, and it is yum yum, in fact. Mmm, smells good. So one more flavor. If I'm not boring y'all to death, you can turn it off if you don't like it. This is VG Honey Vanilla. And this one is 100% VG, I believe. So it should have a lot of vapor. It's not going to focus for me. Just as I learned how to focus my camera when it was about six inches lower, now I've thrown myself off again. Mm, it smells good, but not as good as Yum Yum or the Tea Chew. And normally they send me a bracelet, but this time, and pirate money. This time they sent me pirate money, pirate coins, two of them, front and back. Anyway, now I've opened everything. I get to clean my mess up and um, get my little atomizers out and... You know what? Maybe I'll do that anyway. Let's see. Which one should I try? I think I'm going to try the Fruit Strike Gum because I've never had that before. That's pretty thick. And then I'll let y'all go. Or you can leave now. That's pretty good. I'm getting, um, it tastes like a piece of green fruit stripe gum. Oops, that's the wrong one. Like prominently, um, really sweet lime. It's kind of
kind of light and fruity and refreshing. Yep, that's pretty good. And so far, the juices I've tried from Pirate Vape have been great right out of the mail, except for the one I don't care for, which is the Double Dutch. Anyway, I'm going to let you all go. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye.